Hey guys, it's Big Dave here for Tales of Tolara, and it is Tuesday, and you know that means Warfronts is a day late. Why is Warfronts late? Well, I was sick over the weekend, and you may still be able to hear it in my voice. My sinuses are rebelling. Not sure if it's allergies or what, but they have just been giving me trouble over the last month or so, and I had almost no voice on Saturday night, which is the night that I normally record episodes of Warfronts. So we are going to go in today live. We're going to do a live commentary, and that's not something that I often do on Warfronts, because frankly, it's not in line with the theme of the show. Normally, we want to take a look back at our at our replay, and we want to analyze it uh, from a standpoint of an outsider who isn't in the moment. But every now and then, it's good to actually take a look at our decision-making process in real time. So let's go ahead and queue up. And we are going to take whatever comes our way. We are going to play it. I am going to talk to you in real time about the bad decisions that I am making. And you guys can have a laugh. So hopefully the queue will not embarrass me by taking too long. Looks like about a minute across the board. A couple minutes. Okay. So uh, something should be popping any minute now. Let's see here. We have the lovely Sanctum in the background. Lovely. Lovely building right there. Some fabulous architecture. Just killing time, killing time. I think I saw a deer. Yes, there's a deer. We can kill him. Because though we are guardians, that does not mean that we can't be cruel and merciless. Yes. And it is the Black Garden, isn't it always? All right, guys, here we go. And excellent, we are into a match which has not yet begun, so that bodes well for us. Gives us the opportunity to start fresh, to start from scratch. Sizing up our team here, we have a healer, we have a tank spec who might change that. And yes, we're falling in line, couple mages, couple of rogues, warrior, and a cleric for the healing. All right, so this is shaping up to be pretty good. Uh, not uh, looking to work on any specific aspect of my game. I will tell you I'm extremely rusty with the mage. I played one warm-up game, and uh, my fingers are just going every which way. Some of that could be the equilibrium issues that I'm having from my sinuses, and uh, if I play really embarrassingly, that's what I'm going to blame it on. Oh, my equilibrium was off, so I wasn't pressing the right button at the right time with the right vigor. So let's hope that I don't have to make that excuse, right? So somebody suggested that I switch over to Archon as my uh, as my third spec, and I've done that, but you're not really going to see me doing anything with it because I haven't had the time to uh, figure out where to put the Archon abilities or to create a macro that might uh, ease my use of those abilities. So let's head into battle. I'm going to try to not embarrass myself. I'm going to do what I can to actually play competently. Very often on Warfronts, I record three or four games and then use the best one. So we'll see what happens when we're doing this live. Guys coming out fast. All right, let's make him pay. Random level up there. Okay, I'll take that. Yeesh, wow. Pumped out a lot of damage into that guy for not much reward, but, you know, such is my life. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and respond to this marked gentleman, whether or not he is an actual threat. I don't know, but he's marked, so someone considers him badass enough to want to kill. Alright, so we have the fang off the bat here. That's a nice way to start things out. That mage pulls away as soon as he realizes that I'm on him. Smart. All right, see what we can do here as we uh, throw out. That was not the right spell I used at the right, <laughs> right spell, wrong time kind of thing right there. I actually meant to, to uh, unleash a storm shackle, but that did not exactly work out. I was like, turn my headphones down because they're really jamming in my ears. I'm not actually accustomed to playing this game very loud. I'm going to let the other guy with his beautiful beard actually pick that up. And we are going to reinforce, and we're going to see what we can do to hold this fang and win this game in short order. They are not even coming off the hill. All right. 
I guess they've just conceded. They're going to let us have it. Wonderful. I am going to assume there's probably a sneaky mage sneaking around somewhere sneakily, as they so often do. And finally, they're making some kind of move here. That's good. We've got our cleric healing our fang holder, and everything looks just jolly. We'll go ahead and unload on this guy, which was just a distraction, naturally. All right, warrior, just giving everybody a squirrel. Just squirreling everybody here for a minute. Just give them all squirrels. I'll try to get Storm Shackle. That's not Storm Shackle. Storm Shackle on him, and I can't do it. Uh, one thing I will say, unfortunately, I have changed mouses, mices, mice. I have a different mouse, and uh, it's not very conducive to my playstyle. For some reason, the buttons are just uh, not right. It's... Um, yeah, not working out. It's an unbranded mouse. I mean, it's it's actually pretty nice, uh, but it came with my desktop, or my laptop. It's a, a Republic of Gamers mouse. I don't know who actually makes it, but uh, something about the button placement just isn't right for me. So I am struggling to get used to it, and as such, I am not hitting all of my keys correctly because I do utilize all five buttons of the mouse as well as six or seven buttons on the keyboard for my keybinds. All right, a little kill in action here. Fang is down. Okay, so we are going to continue to hang on to the Fang, and this is really, this game has become sort of in the bag at this point. Okay, now we want to use Cinder. There we go. All right, that's good. That's better. And finish him off. All right. And yeah, at this point, they've pretty much conceded. And it actually kind of ends up being all right that this game is short because I'm already feeling my voice uh, escaping me. And that is not very good. So we're going to finish this up in short order. This is going to be a little bit of an odd episode of Warfronts in that it really isn't a very good episode. It's not something you're going to learn anything from. It's just me talking until I lose my voice, which is about to happen in uh, probably a minute or so. So I apologize, guys, that uh, this episode is kind of on the subpar side, but I didn't want to leave you guys alone uh, for the whole week with nothing from me. One thing that I want to mention as this sort of finishes up is that I'm going to be streaming on Twitch.tv. I'm going to be streaming on my Big Dave is Cheap account, Twitch.tv slash Big Dave is Cheap. And I'm going to stream anything I play, and that includes Rift. I will not be streaming Rift exclusively. I will not be streaming Rift on a schedule. But if I'm playing Rift, I will stream Rift. So you guys might want to tune in for that. Head over to twitch.tv slash bigdaveischeap. Follow me there, and you'll get a notification when I actually do stream. I'm going to start streaming in the next two weeks or so. And as I said, if I'm playing it, I will stream it. And Rift is one of those games that I play quite frequently. So I will probably be streaming some Rift from time to time. I think I'm going to do some leveling on one of my lower characters as well as some Warfront runs when I have a few minutes. So check that out if you're interested. Again, apologize for this episode of Warfronts. It is uh, quite frankly mailed in at this point as I'm looking at it in retrospect. But uh, I really didn't want to leave you guys with, with, with nothing at all. So... Thanks for hanging with me, guys. Thanks for your continued support. I hope everybody's enjoying uh, Rift, and I hope you're looking forward to the new patch 1.8, which is about to drop, uh, I believe, later this week. Is it later this week? I think it is. Oh, some nasty defiance have invaded my, my space. Hmm, okay. Well, while I butcher these defiants who cannot defend themselves whatsoever from my fiery fury, I will bid you guys adieu. I hope you have a wonderful evening, a wonderful morning, a wonderful night, a wonderful day, whenever it is that you're watching this, and I hope you'll be back here next week for Warfront. I have been Big Dave, and as always, take it easy. <laughs>